What's going on, fellow pyros? You guys know what time it is. Here we are again, Red Apple Fireworks. It's 2020. Hope you guys are being safe. Obviously, you guys see I have my mask on. There in the reflection. So the purpose of this video is I wanted to create a point of reference for a lot of you guys interested in purchasing product here. This is gonna be a very long video because I don't think it's been done before. We're gonna walk all the way around and examine every piece of product that they have here in the store. Wonder how long it's gonna take because they've made a lot of changes. So let's go in here and see what they got. You guys know what time it is. Right, guys here we go so this is a point of entrance when you come into the store they've changed a lot of things so those double doors you guys were used to entering in uh, that's all gone now this is over here this is where the ATM machine used to be but this is the front door now so um, this is where the cash registers and stuff used to be and this is the store it's really really packed in here um, I've never seen it this stocked. I mean, this place has always been huge, but it's stuff all over the place. They got a lot of good stuff in inventory. And so obviously you guys know since Nevada is on lockdown, we are not buying any fireworks today. We are just doing a video to create a point of reference for all of you guys interested in the website. So we're gonna take a little quick run around and then we are going to examine every piece that they have to offer. And I hope I have enough battery life to cover everything. All right, so that is pretty much the entire store. So we're gonna run around really quick. We're gonna examine everything. Uh, this is where the registers are gonna go. They're still in the process of remodeling. And this aisle right here, this is for all the orders currently going out for all of you guys who've been using Keo Daikin 10 on the Red Apple Fireworks website. Make sure you guys use that code. Also use the link that I provided for you guys to help save you guys some money. <clears throat> so. Here we go, we're gonna go ahead and get started. This will be a very long video. There's a lot of stuff here to cover. So, uh, in fact, let's go ahead and start with, uh, we're gonna start here, and we're gonna go all the way around on the outskirts of the store, and then we're gonna come back and kinda go down the aisles. All right? And as you see, the Red Apple crew is busy at work getting your orders ready. All right, so here we have the assortments. This is the, looks like it's the Gorilla Box up there. I don't know, let me see, 500 bucks for the case. You got all those there. 
everything is 1.4 G included. This is the Cavalera assortment for 242. For the case, 150 for the unit. My best guess is probably two that comes in there for the case. Got the Z box. Hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. Here we have uh, the Cobra box. This is one of the more popular cases and assortments. There's a lot of safe and sane stuff in there. You guys don't have to worry about too much aerials, but I believe there may be a few. Those are going for 79 bucks each, 175 for the case. And I do believe there's three in a case. So these are your Cobra box fireworks assortment samplers and they've drastically changed a lot of the marketing material on these boxes because originally they looked like this. Now they look all flying pimped out. Hey man, how's it going? It's good, how are you? Good. So in case you guys are wondering, the store is closed. I was just granted access to come in here and record for you guys. Here's the Dragon Box, another Red Apple exclusive, 60 bucks for the unit. There's three of these in the case, right, for the assortments? Yes. Yeah, so each one of the assortments that you guys get, if you get the case, is get uh, you get three in the case for 165. And over here we have the Panda Box. Panda Box is currently going for 65 bucks for the unit, 165. For the case. Oh, there we go. I don't know why my GoPro camera always gets fogged up. And here we have the monkey box. $42. That's actually pretty good. $42. I'm not sure how many are in this case. I know these are a little bit smaller than the panda boxes and the other ones. So these are pretty good. So there's probably three in the case, my best guess. I get confirmation on that a little bit later. This one's new to me. Uh, this is the blast case, $55 per unit. This is really good for kids. I like how they are marketing this. I mean, the kids seem to love this type of material. This is like a little plastic bag and it has like a lot of fireworks in here. And we have a window case or a assortment pack, $95 for the case. Uh, I don't see the price on the individual pack. So I'm guessing, well, I don't want to guess. So uh, call the store if you guys have any questions. So. And over here we have the Brothers Assortment Pack. This one's a little narrower than the Monkey Box. Uh, this is $35 per unit. So maybe this price for the single unit on the window is somewhere between 55 and 35. So maybe 45, maybe so. And that is called the buzz assortment. Oh, there's actually six in one. Okay, for the buzz. And brother is $65 for the unit, 209 for the case. And this one's another six in one. Nice job. Okay, so some of the smaller ones have six in one as compared to three in one. So still a good buy. So I'm going to speak on some of this stuff a little bit later. I don't want to get ahead of myself. All right, so we're going to stay against the wall again. So let's cover this end cap and we're going to go all the way to the back and go all the way around. So from this position in the store, 
If you guys are familiar, this is where you would normally line up and buy your stuff at the far end corner of the store. So now we're over here. They've changed a lot of things. Now I'm not gonna call out all the individual prices for you guys. Just try to show some of this nice and slow. These are your barrel bombs. Not exactly sure what these are. These are like firecrackers, okay. So there's a lot of new product here and keep in mind, as full as I've seen this store here right now, they still don't have all their stuff in. So I don't know where they're gonna put it. Oh yeah, you guys are taking it home. All right, so we got plenty of stuff up there at the top. And over here, these, this looks like your 200 gram aisle, because I know they've moved a lot of stuff. So I believe this is what this is. Uh, this is a daytime firework. Sorry, I had to jump ahead. Love this one. Um, this one's really nice for a daytime. You guys would love the smoke dragons. All right, so smoke dragons are 14 bucks. Heck, that is a great price. I think these used to cost $25. Nice job, Doug. Yeah, 108 for the case. That's not too bad. That's good. I'm a huge daytime fireworks guy. So, Shogun ready to rumble, $10. Again, I'm not going to quote all the prices here. That's what the video's for. And for those of you guys watching, if you feel like I'm going a little too fast, I do believe that YouTube has a slowdown option on the... Uh, I know you can speed it up about two times. I'm not sure if you can slow it down. But anyway, that's what the pause button is for. All right, we're still here in the, I believe this is the 250 gram or 200 gram section, sorry. And just so you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of 200 gram cakes. I'm just not. Um, I don't know, it's just something about the whole whistling effect. But again, I do know that they're fillers to help fill up the sky with the rest of your show but it's just not my personal preference. Uh, these are some um, aerial repeaters here. I'm familiar with these. These things are really great. Make a lot of good noises and stuff. Um, good effects, 61 shots. These are eight bucks. So I believe this is a cheaper price than what I've seen in the previous year. So it's pretty nice. And so for me, the way I like to shop or do price comparisons is compared to previous years on the same product. So some of the prices that I've shown you guys that have actually dropped uh, you are saving money and of course remember that there may be products that may have risen in price due to stuff that's been going on in china but please keep in mind that if you are buying a product you're familiar with and it costs a little bit more uh, they may have changed the prices on something else so you can save money that way so it all balances out
These are missile barrages. Saturn missiles. And for those of you who aren't familiar with what Saturn missiles are, all they do is those are the ones that go vee, 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 and they keep making a bunch of noises. And, you know, they're not your high explosive items that you guys may be looking for. They're definitely not fountains. But they add to your show what I call mid air fillers. We got all this stuff down here at the bottom. All right. So. Now we're moving to some bigger items and I'm not sure if we're still done with the 200 grammers, but that's what we have right now. So these are our flash crackers here. Most of this is all um, firecrackers. And these actually do put out a flash. I've shot off several of these and they do flash a little bit more than your standard firecrackers. So for those of you guys who've never seen these in person or not familiar with Red Apple product, $99 for the case. Uh, I'm not sure if there's only one in the case. Probably that's usually how these are packed, but please check the website or call the store for more information. 16,000, awesome. 8,000. $72 for the case. We have all these down here. And then you have the window brand for the flash crackers, $99 for the case. And there's a guy named Pyroethics. Uh, I believe he's actually shot off this one. He has a video on it. I think it has about 600,000 views. So check that out if you guys have any questions about how that one performs. All right, let's move back on to the prices. We have our 4,000 shot platinum flash crackers. Got our aqua bombs. Uh, <laughs> CZ Celtic, American Patriot. Uh, blew up uh, somebody's toilet with one of these. <laughs> That's all I'll say about that. Of course, he replaced it. All right, now we've reached the end of this cap right here. So just, these are more your aqua bombs and everything else, your barrel bombs, other firecrackers. So everything that was on that end cap way down there is right here. And we have our double and triple break arrow shots right here. These are going for $19 for the unit, $139 for the case. All right, so let's go over to the other aisle. So we can go ahead and knock this one out. Ah, yeah, see, this is the rest of the 200 gram section here. <clears throat> All right, so we have our signature series, $45 for the unit. Firehawk, Palm Beach. Let me just zoom in on these prices for you guys.
Okay. I've never heard this store so quiet. <laughs> All right, so if you guys see anything on this aisle, you know where to find it in the store or where to reference the sales associate if you guys need to call in and place an order. Again, this is on the back side of the store near where the registers are, or they're gonna be, near the main warehouse door, so. So these are some more of your things. Uh, you know, normally I know they've changed a lot of the price tags on here. In case you guys are wondering, these are QR codes. So you, if you guys have one of those scanners on your phone, you can come in the store scanning. It tells you exactly what it does. Uh, normally, I know the labels tell you exactly a little bit more, a little bit more descriptive. But that's probably why they just replaced it with the QR code. Code. So uh, feel free to check it out. Um. This is one of my favorites right here. This one here, I love. These are confetti cakes. Gotta love these, another daytime firework. This is another another one that's on my top tier list. Uh, wow, I think these used to be either 35 or $45 a unit. So these are $25 now. Um, if you guys don't know, daytime fireworks are really, really expensive because they pack a little bit more power. This will make a mess. You guys will be cleaning up your neighborhood for couple of weeks with just one of these um i shot one off and crap was all in a tree and two days to get out my neighbors were cool but really great cake you launch this with the uh smoke dragon great daytime effects excellent show all right 250 12 dollars i think i've covered eye candy All right, moving on. We're still here in the aerial repeater section of the store for video reference. And I do believe behind me are more of the 500 gram cakes, which I will take my time on. I know one of the biggest complaints when I've seen some of these firework video walkthroughs is you're going too fast. So trying to make sure I get everything for you guys. All right, so those are more of your 200 grammars. Hey, sounds like the man of the hour is here. All right, we got Bright Star, seven bucks. Some other Red Apple exclusives. And you know, I love how Red Apple uh, creates a signature series and they brand their product. Um, I won't go into too much detail about it, but I've noticed that a lot of uh, fireworks out there use different brand labels and stuff. And I've always wondered if that stuff is well, I know it's copyrighted by somebody or trademarked, but if they are getting exclusive permission to use those. So for example, if you guys are familiar with Space Ghost, you would typically see that on some of the firework labels. And um, you don't see it every year, but in a lot of stores you do. And so Red Apple, they really don't do too much of that. They create their own product. They create their own labels. They believe their own brand. And so they're doing things the right way over here.
and it looks like we got some stuff up there okay that's a case um you guys are gonna have to call about these i'm not sure okay it is dream wave 13 for the unit 65 dollars a case that's a pretty big unit for 13 bucks that's a large aerial 12 shots that's you can't beat that these are some nice sizes right here i kid you not that's nice that's a nice size that's not your standard aerial repeater size either you know what in fact hold on this is a standard let me grab this this is your standard aerial repeater i know this is in a box but he's a lot larger Doug, what's going on, man? What's up, dude? Just recording for the store. Nice. You guys, we got Doug here. How you feeling? Good, man. We're social distancing. <laughs> <laughs> I think I already got the antibodies, so I'm cool. Oh, nice, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm just walking around the store right now for everybody, getting all the prices and stuff on here. So nice. Nice. this video is probably going to be like three hours, maybe. Oh, my gosh. Maybe. You got so much stuff in there, man. We're loaded. I'm telling you, we're, we're good to go. We yeah. got lots of product on the way, too. Uh, another one of the favorite brands here, the Ganja so doug why are you standing you want to tell me about this one that one is actually this is its last year this year whatever you see that's all we got left on this particular ganja brand but we got a lot of other ganja products coming in all right guys we're gonna finish our walk around we're gonna be here for a while because there's Take a lot time. of stuff here have fun man i was like where is everything i was like where are the double doors where's the how are you supposed to get in here we're working on it all right, F0, uh, for you guys who don't, uh, if you guys didn't watch any of my previous videos, uh, this used to be the G4 series. Uh, F0 now is a combination of the UV and G Force. So even if you see the G4 shells, or I'm sorry, the F0 shells, those are a combination of the best UV and G4 shells. So keep that in mind anytime you see the F0 label. Calavera. Another top-notch brand right there. I'm familiar with the shells, not too familiar with any of the 200 gram repeater stuff. All right. And then we have the Tropics. So uh, the Tropics case, this is $89 for the case, $42 for, the, for a unit. Okay. Uh, $14 each. Hey, uh, Doug, quick question. Uh, the ganja, the aerial repeaters, you have the case is 89, the unit is 42, but each piece is 14. One more time. The ganja aerial repeaters? Uh -huh. The case is 89, mm -hmm. the unit is 42, and then what's for, so what are these two? So this is gonna be for a single piece like this. Okay. And the 42 would be for one uh, inner box. So this is four pieces. Okay, so then what's the case? The case would be two inner boxes like that ah uh, mm -hmm. okay so that's new this year as far as the new pricing structure so you got the cases 89 which is down here eight aerials yep okay and then the unit is four mm -hmm. uh aerials exactly and then the piece is obviously what you guys see right there exactly okay perfect yep all right guys let's go ahead and move on to the 500 gram section here so we're on the end cap now of the 500 gram cake section uh, in front of me, we still have some of the rest of the Panda boxes. Make sure you guys visit redapplefireworks.com and apply discount code KEELDIKEN10 to get additional $10 off. And there's also free shipping on $1,000 on $1, or more. So, $999 or more. Oh, $999.99. <laughs> All right, so... I'm not too familiar with a lot of these cakes right here, so I'll just go over the pricing for you guys. Uh, how many are in each case for the 500 grams this year? It varies per item. Um, on that cannon that you're looking at right there, that okay. one has four. Right. Jet Propulsion has four. Off the deep end, four. Most of them on average are gonna be four. Okay. Kill the Evil Clown, you might get like, that one has six. All right. World Class Firehawk. Firehawk puts out some good stuff here, guys, so. Make sure you guys check that out. Bright Star. I haven't shot this one, but I think I've seen it at demo. But everything here in the store is really good, so you don't have to worry about that. So perfectly stocked on that stuff. 
Nice. It's brand new. Oh, you can tell? Yeah, I know. Just came in. Okay. Yeah, a lot of this stuff you're seeing right here from uh, Winda and Brightstar, brand new for this year. All right. All right, camera had to, or the GoPro got too hot, so I had to switch over for a minute. All right, so here we are back again in the 500 gram section. Sorry, this isn't in widescreen format. Here we go. Oh no, go ahead. All right, that's more world-class stuff. So remember guys, this is still the 500 gram section. And they're definitely fully loaded, but when you guys come here, I can promise you, it won't be as full. Now I know this particular cake here is used for like a baby reveal. Was, uh, I don't believe it's used for that occasion, whether she's pink or blue. I've actually shot it, but I can't remember. So I don't distinctly, distinctively remember if it's for a boy or girl baby reveal party. So uh, I do know that it's a good cake though. So just want you guys to keep that in mind. All right, these are still orders going out to you people at home. Again, make sure you check your local jurisdictions to find out if it is legal to shoot fireworks in your area or to have it delivered. <clears throat> All right, so we are on the end cap of the 500 gram section. So on this particular side, let's go on the back door. As you guys can see, got the Neon Fusions. Put your double brakes, triple brakes, single shot shells, $35 for the box, $149 for the case. Uh, fear no evil, so there's six in this uh, case right here. So that's one of them, so that gives you guys a better idea about what you're getting. All right, so here we are again. This is the Meteor Gun. And for those of you guys who have never seen the Meteor Gun, this is 21 Shot Aerial. This came in last year, one of their new products here for Red Apple. In fact, I remember Doug mentioned that to me last year at CES 2019 when he met me over at the, uh, what's the name of that place? The Gamer Lounge place? Oh, Esports Arena. <laughs> A hydrogen bomb, another excellent 500 gram uh, cake, 36 shots. Me personally, I would prefer a 500 gram with like about 12 shots or 25, so that way you get a little bit more bang and powder. But <clears throat> if you guys want a little bit more duration in a 500 grammer heavy heavy hitter, 36 shots, it's really good. 
Um, I know they used to have the Temple of Heaven. That thing was huge. It was probably like four of these all together. 500 grammar. Definitely hit. Here we go again. Ant. Open fire. <clears throat> Sons of Liberty. All this is Brothers product right here, so they got their section off pretty good. And brothers. And we got Hyperdrive. These are some Hyperdrive cakes. $62 for the unit. I'm sorry, for the case, $24 for the unit. F-Zero series. So again, remember, that's the old G-Force and UV stuff there. Starstruck, Star Keeper. Uh, those are some of my top tier cakes. I'll get into that a little bit later. So we'll cover that. But uh, all those are some excellent cakes there. At least the ones I'm familiar with again. So I don't want to give you guys the impression that one of these is better than something else. But just tell you about what I'm familiar with. One of my personal recommendations. <coughs> Yeah, second to none. All right, Lizard's Eye. This is probably a sleeper, so I bet my money on that one. It's probably a good one. It reminds me of the Viper that they had a few years ago. All right, so here we go. Iron Tiger 50 shot XL aerials. Um... There's probably two of these in the case. So for 70 bucks, $42 a unit. It's another 500 grammar. So yeah, there's probably two of those in that box right there. Sweet Spot Remix. Okay. All right, got some more. This one's a 48 shotter, rolled gold. Pretty decent. $35 in standard prices are pretty good. For, these are all pretty good prices for 500 grammars. I mean, back in the day, they averaged at 65, 70 bucks, 55 or so for 500 gram cake. So you guys have some options here with um, cakes costing $25 entry level. So those are all some pretty good prices on the cakes. And then of course, over here, we have our Firehawk. No, actually, what $3. I sent him on this last order was... And I'm familiar with this one, Iron Sides. It's a really good cake. 25 bucks, not bad. And of course, here we are on the end. We got the Meteor Gun 21 shot XL Aerial. All right, here you guys go. We're getting closer to some of the more familiar cakes. That's what I saw. Yeah, they're on the floor. So it's like a total of 34 pounds instead of 60 or 58. Because I was not looking forward to unloading 600 or something. So many pandas. I'll take them. <laughs> All right, here uh, for the case of the. Uh, I think there's still four that come in the case here for the Cal Calavera. Uh, these are these are some heavy hitters. I mean, trust me, guys. I mean, I know a lot of guys who recommend these. You guys don't want to miss out on these. And uh, for those of you guys not familiar, again, on the East Coast, you've never shopped here at Red Apple. Uh, another personal recommendation. This set here, shooting all four of those at once. $99 for the case. Uh, Doug, quick question. How much? The quick question, how much for the piece? Yeah. For the, uh... Yeah. Oh, he's talking somewhere. Uh, brothers, game over unit, 16 bucks. All right. So, call and double check the piece price for the Calavera. So, Doug's busy right now. All right, so that completes... 
that aisle there. So we've just completed two end caps. And so let's go ahead and take a look at one of the other shelves here. We're gonna go down this aisle. Another good cake there and Saturday night special and medalist, all three right next to each other. Those are all some more of my personal recommendations there. So make that on your list. Write that on your list. Bombastic, we got world class. World class, Shogun, Signature Series. Blonde joke. These prices are either cheaper or equivalent to what they've been in these previous years. So make sure you guys remember that. I think these normally go for 45. But remember what I said earlier in the video? You know, I will admit it's kind of hard to record and shop here at the same time. I know some people have uh, said so in my videos as far as, hey man, like, how much was that or something like, you know. But, you know, when you guys come here on a mission, and I understand that you make that track over here, you guys got your mind on your pyro, you know, recording last. So, that's why I wanted to take this opportunity to go ahead and help you guys out with this. Yowza's another good cake, 35 bucks. I think that's the standard price or it's been a little bit more expensive over the past few years, 21 shots. I'd highly recommend this one. I mean, like again, I love the heavy weights or the heavy hitters with uh, 21 shots. Get a little more bang out of it. Just waiting for you guys to come pick it up. Obviously when everything opens again. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Oh, Leah, quick question. Do you know the individual price of the Cavalera? Uh, yeah. I can look it up for you. Because I know it's not listed there. Give me one sec. Thank you. All right, publicity stunt. All right, so the Cavalera uh, cakes individually are $28. So that's really good. I think that's a little bit lower than normal than what they uh, normally are. So make sure you guys write that down. Jump for joy. Hit the road jack. Hope I didn't miss any of these prices for you guys. Let me slow down a little bit. Highfalutin. Oh, highfalutin. Never seen that one here before. Another signature series, $35 for the unit. $95 for the case. And I think we have reached the end cap of the 500 gram section. Hope you guys enjoyed that quick tour. Oops. 
Hope you guys enjoyed that quick tour. So now we're going to move on to something else. I know we got some other things going on and you guys can't wait to get to the shells. So we'll make sure we cover that. Moving on. Let's see, what section is this? This is, I think we're still in the 500 gram section. So with the end cap, we got some double repeaters or triple brakes and uh, the double brakes. Getting closer now to some of my favorites and other brands that I've personally have experienced with. <laughs> these are the ones. Oh, let me before I get ahead of myself, let me get these prices $25, 28 If you guys are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I'd really appreciate that. I believe in working for whatever's given to me. So, but other than that, I hope you guys enjoy some content. I like to try to be diverse in what I bring to you guys. And, I try to bring the same old thing. All right, so I've shot these before. Moon Festival, Skylines. These are all really good cakes right here. Um, they had these at demo last year, 2019. You guys can reference some of the other videos online for that. But these are really good cakes. Um, I'm trying to remember. I know it's a large cake, but I'm not sure if they're 500 grammars. I don't think they are. I think they're somewhere between, so... Uh, forgive my lack of vocabulary in terms of what they would be called they're in between 200 grams and 500 so but you got them there also i want to give a special shout out to pyro you know who you are pyro uverse really proud of you man you guys definitely mature young man make sure you guys check out his channel pyro Uverse. he runs a little group uh pyro freaks association really cool guy loves playing call of duty so he knows his stuff i know he's busy with growing up duties and stuff now but he's a very mature young man and um, i'm proud of him so I remember some time ago, he actually started some type of pyro chat. We did about two or three times and stuff, but I thought it was a really good idea. So I thought about maybe taking up the reins and doing a little bit more of that myself, which is why I did the interview with Doug uh, a couple weeks ago. But uh, that was really interesting. And, uh, you know, he kind of started that whole thing about doing a little pyro talk. And, but we only did a few sessions of it a few years ago. And it was just between, the, I think, three or four of us. You know, whoever was a, being a guest. So it was pretty cool. <clears throat> All right, we got our hologram up there, Motor City. Uh, $67 for the unit. $1.15 for the case. We got the Pagodas. Dragon King. So if you guys are looking for these, uh, through this video and you need somebody to come and run and grab it. I think we are on the I think this is what the third or fourth aisle. It's definitely in the middle of the store. Temple of Heaven. Uh, $35 for the unit. $90 for the case. Let's see three aerials. So I believe there's three in here. Okay. 
Definitely good series, but I still miss that other one. See, the other one that they used to have was this size right here. There's only one of them, and it was 100, uh, one 500 gram cake. Had a punch to it, so they don't have those anymore. And I think I grabbed the last one. Uh, it was two years ago, so I missed that one. So hopefully they bring it back sometime. After dark, to level up and all the other good goodies right here. It's pretty nice. Got a retro video game feel here, it does. And then we have our ganja shells. Uh, sorry, ganja cake. Ganja cake, XL Ariel. So this is a 500 grammer. Uh, anytime you guys see XL, that's typically what it is. 30 shots. Angry Pandas, I know that one's kind of sold usually across the country and stuff. So um, some of you in the Midwest, obviously on the East Coast, um, I know it's kind of hard to say, hey, if Red Apple Fireworks, well, what's comparable to Red Apple Fireworks? And so a few years ago, Thought it was interesting. I asked um, I had talked to Cody B Pyrotechnics. If you guys don't know who he is, check out his channel. Um, I was really I'm ha I was really happy when uh, him and a few other guys ordered some Red Apple product on the East Coast so they could do an actual comparison because we don't have access to a lot of the stuff there and a lot of places don't ship to the uh, West Coast. So it was cool to see how Red Apple stands up against some of the other competitors and companies out there. And so uh, based upon his recommendation and some of the other guys, they were really impressed with what uh, the product Red Apple Fireworks puts out. So I was really happy with that because it's always good to compare product, like, you know, like a scrimmage or something, you know, just to compare what something has or, you know, to something else. Because um, the only cakes that I can think of, maybe Angry Pandas and Gorilla Warfare, those are usually the only two kind of cakes that Red Apple has where other competitors may have it, but Red Apple has a lot of their own stuff, so can't really compare their product to other stuff unless you've actually shot it. <coughs> All right, I was right. So this is the third shelf over. We're here in the middle of the store. So if you guys are looking for all your 500 grammars, you got this aisle and this aisle, but all three of these shelves here are all 500 gram sections. And oh my god. Oh, Doug's doing a little video. <laughs> all right, so it looks like we still got some more 500 gram cakes to look at right now. Leah, you want to say something for the camera? <laughs> all right. Tiki Tiki, 27 shots. I uh, don't know how much these are by the piece. I'll find out later. Rent label, $29. Cometa, ah. I'll get back to that one later. <laughs> Excellent cake though, Excellent cake. $29 for the case. Oh, I'm sorry, $89 for the case, $29 for the unit. Cometa, 38 shots. Great one there. Uh, Leah, good question. Or, uh, what's the individual price for a Tiki 27 shot cake? Okay, so it's a Tiki shot? We actually don't sell individually. Okay, so it's a, oh, I see. So it's, okay. This is another one you guys need to watch out for. So this is probably the second or third box 
that probably breaks the norm. So this is 135 for the case and you get all of these there too. So it's a combination of different cakes there, different sizes. So it's not pieced out, it's 135 for the case. So think of that as a miniature cake assortment. Great deal. Sunflower bomb. So we're gonna cover all this stuff here. Just wanna give you guys a little heads up. You know, you really feel so happy in this store because of all the colors and everything is there. It feels like Christmas. Like you just wanna take something and light it up. Oh, now this one is amazing. Signature series, Mad Bomber. Hey, Doug, I love the uh, packaging on your Mad Bomber Gear Duran, 144 shots. I, I love it. Yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's so different. I mean, the colors are rich. This is probably going to be another one people try to collect. I like, I like that one. That one really pops and it stands out and it's different. And there's four of them, so you can line them up actually like a train. And that's the idea is fuse them all up together. There's four different train cars. Mm -hmm. And so you're supposed to line them up next to each other. Like a train, fuse them together, hit one fuse, and you get 144 shots. Is that a, it's not an aerial repeater, it's a cake, right? 500? It's a, it's a cake, yeah. 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 Hell yeah. I know a few guys they love collect collecting, so yeah, that one's. That's pretty, definitely pretty collectors. Well. I gotta do one more take on my story, okay? All right. Oh, boom! Got flowers. Freedom Max. <coughs> Doom, Skyfall, Freedom Max. You know, I could probably go to sleep in here. I know it would be hazardous, but. <laughs> oh, man. All right, red label, uh, red, red label, $28 for the Night Blossom. We got the Blossoms. Uh, Skyfall, Doom, Ghost, $30 for the unit. Cannon, KGB Agent. Oh, let me get those prices for you guys. <clears throat> All right, Pyro Star. Here we go again. We got some Pyro Star cakes. Twenty-nine dollars for the unit. Ninety-four dollars for the case. You get four of those in a box. It's pretty good, nice to have. Kung Fu, Black Tiger. All right, let's see. Make sure I got this price on the arcade. That's appropriate for everything else I'd like to do. Then we got a Pyro Star. After Dark. All right, are we done? Are we done with the 500 gram cakes? So I'm in the back of the store, guys, just as another quick reference point. Uh, to my far right, that is where this is. Now, remember this aisle right here where the shells are? This is where the assortments used to be. And over there, that's over all the orders, and that's where that big door is. A point of reference for all of you guys. So, all right, let's move on to the next section in the store. And all this you guys see here, order is going out. So, one of the things about Red Apple is they are always ahead of the competition. And that's not to me literally, you know, as far as anybody else, because there's other businesses out there I respect too. But I'm just saying that they stay busy. You know, they look ahead to the future. And that's one of the reasons why I love this place and why I love the company and why I appreciate the uh, Berta family and everything that they do. All right. Double breaks, triple breaks. Uh, other Canon brand stuff there. Happy face, that one actually makes a happy face there. One of the first aerials I ever shot off it was a happy face, and it does go up, and it 
does make a smiley face just like that. So pretty cool. All right, guys, let's take a look at another section. Still moving on. I think, you know, I think the most difficult section in the story to record would be, be the um, novelties. Because there's too many. Because there's so many pieces. Yeah, see, a lot of this stuff here is just big stuff. Oh, I love these. You know, I've never shot off one of these. They're, they're loud. <clears throat> the issue with those, it's, you know, it's a ball shelf, so it breaks 360 degrees. Mm -hmm. The only issue is that dollar for dollar shells are a better price, you know? But still, I mean, just to have one of those, because I've never shot one of those. You can make your own rack with those, too. That's a really the way to do it. And speaking of racks, uh, Red Apple Fireworks does have theirs. Uh, we will get to that in a moment. Is that an Ethan? Well, he's right behind. I'm almost getting ahead of myself here, guys. All right, brothers, $105 for the case. Uh, I think this is an individual unit as well as the window, $85. Uh, amazing ballet. So this is what you guys are getting here. Too happy. America. Nobody's messing with his amendment rights. Alright. Firehawk Steel Navy Corps of USA. Detroit Fireworks. So I know Mike did an extensive review some time ago on Detroit fireworks so check out his video uh, I think it's under yeah this should be on the Red Apple fireworks channel because I know they did some rebranding and I know it uh, the most parts Red Apple fireworks in some places was called Motor City fireworks so I'm not sure if everything's been fully changed I believe it has so just check out their website for that or their Facebook Red Apple fireworks And this looks like another assortment here. We have poker, $135 for the case. So this is what you should be getting if, yeah. This is what you guys should be getting with Lucky 13 right there. So uh, this is like another one. I've never seen this type of case before. So I believe this is number four or five guys where I mentioned uh, they did have some specific pricing on some different stuff. So you do get that combination there. Shogun, $40. Stardust. You guys have seen a previous name for that. That's another excellent cake right there. Make sure you guys pick that one up. Golden or Sky Garden. This looks pretty nice. This looks like three cakes, three aerials in here. Sim City. Star again. This is another Red Apple Signature Series, thirty-five dollars. Uh, Retro Skull, and then we have all these cakes here. Now I don't believe. Let me see if this is a mixed assortment. Now, keep in mind, some of these cakes are mixed assortments, so you can shoot them one at a time. However, a lot of these are meant to be set uh, off in a set, what you call an aerial finale set. So if you take one out of the set, if there's four in the set and you take out one, leaves three, you won't get the true effect that you may have. So let's say, for example, one cake is only blue, another one is only green, another one's orange or whatever. So you're, you're meant to shoot them all at one time. The good thing is, if you guys are putting on a show for yourself, neighborhood, whatever the case might be, and let's say one cake is red, you can mix and match with all your red cakes if you guys want to color coordinate that way. So that's another good thing. Instead of just having a cake that has a mixture 
of all the colors in there you can kind of pick and choose what you guys want for your show so that's just my personal take on it all these fireworks here looking for a happy home signature series so that's just my personal take on it and All right, and here we are by the front door. We just finished one, two, three, four aisles. And then of course we finished all the assortments here. And so now we are moving over or closer into the novelty section. We're getting close guys. And then of course we'll hit the shelves. And then we have our single, uh, we have our nine shot selection racks over here. So let's go ahead and cover that real quick. <clears throat> you know, years ago, it's funny, uh, mother of all bombs. I used to play a video game called Command and Conquer Generals. And one of the guys I used to play with, his screen name was Moab, M-O-A-B. And so it took me a while to figure out or realize that M-O-B, Moab, actually stood for mother of all bombs. So. Commanding Conquer General, one of the best real-time strategy games they ever made. And back in 2000, I think that was 2004. Love that game. Met some, some great guys in there too. I made a lot of maps for that game. And I think there's a new game coming out called Gears of War Tactics, which is somewhat similar to Commanding Conquer General a little bit. So you guys should check that out too. Wacky Tobacco and LOL, excellent shots there. So those are what you call your nine shots. Um, hey Doug, what's the appropriate terminology for these? Nine shell cakes. Shell cakes. Large shell cake. Oh, okay. I thought they were called something else, like nine shot single rack or something like something that. Like people call them all different things. I call them shell cakes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wacky Tobacco. So there's two in each one. So you get uh, the case for 115 and there's each one is 60 bucks. And the box looks amazing too. So that's this entire aisle. You know, there was a cake that I was uh, recommending to somebody. I didn't see it in the store. It's called Fire It Up. A really excellent cake. Maybe they discontinue those. Oh, big blast, addicted mild, flash mob. Sixty-five dollars for the unit, one ten for the case for those. And then of course we have the F Zero Prism Prism. Got all these here. So I just want to run through these prices really quick for you guys. This is what you're looking at on this aisle. Sound and light show. Also, if any of you guys watch any of <clears throat> my other videos, Retro Pie and whatnot, RK Bills, I got some great stuff coming out. And also, some new partnerships I, I can't wait to uh, share with you guys, too. So, I've been talking to a lot of big businesses, people understand my vision and stuff, things that we're doing over here. And uh, I'll let you guys in on that a little bit later. But uh, got some great stuff in the works for you guys. And then, of course, we also have my Venom Retro Pie build, light gun and arcade only image with the Supreme team. So, I want to give a special shout out to Debbie Dig G, Regalod, and all the guys out there for putting in the work. 
Wolf and Nose, Damaso Foundation, all you guys out there. All right, so here we have our fuse. Um, I'm gonna go through these prices really quick. Uh, and see the fuse here is $5, it looks like $5, uh, $7 for the yellow, uh, super fast, but I do believe the quick fuse may be faster than the extra fuse there. Um, all of these here range between five and seven bucks. So for you, if you guys are new to the hobby, and this is one of the things I expressed earlier, um, I know that if, when you buy an assortment, you don't get fuse in the box. And when you buy an assortment case, the assortments, they last, they'll tell you on the box, hey, this is like an hour and 30 minute show, whatever the case might be. Don't just settle for that because it does get boring walking back and forth. And that was one of the things that I did in my first year, um, you know, with in my experience with fireworks. Buy some fuse, fuse as much of it as you can together, and enjoy your show and light it. So that way you guys can actually enjoy the show instead of walking back and forth, trying to light everything individually. Buy some cases of the assortments and light it all up at once or however many you wanna to put together. You will save your feet so much time, effort, and work walking back and forth. Just buy a bunch of fuse, light it all up together, and call it a day. Trust me. I made the rookie mistake thinking I was saving money. And even though I love the assortments, we're gonna cover all of that here in just a few minutes. But it's work. It's a lot of work to light every firework up individually if you have an assortment. And even just picking it out individually. So yes, you can pick out every assortment or every novelty and whatnot individually. You will save so much time and energy just getting some additional fuse, fusing it up together, and enjoying your show and you know enjoying your show so um hey doug do you still sell the cobras here cobra box. Uh, firing system uh, okay so yeah red apple fireworks also sells the cobra firing system so if you guys want if you want to be like me and take the lazy route i know it's an <laughs> investment for, for about 500 bucks or so roughly for the receiver and uh the module um it's it's very expensive in terms of i mean 500 dollars isn't a lot of money but it is if you're using it maybe once a year but it'll last you for however long it is and scott and guys over at cobra joel they put in some really good work there so i made the investment year, years ago i said screw it i'm going to take the um the dive bought a cobra firing system and i love it you know even though i use it once a year roughly <laughs> uh it's a it's a great investment so so make sure you guys get a Cobra firing system. And these are all our fountains again. Crystal geyser. This one looks familiar. Ballerin is ball. That's an excellent fountain there. I usually get cases of those. Those are really nice. All this right here is our safe and sane stuff. So you guys are cool even if you're in California. And there we go. You guys didn't know my favorite, my favorite fountain. Well, I wouldn't say my favorite firework, but it's my favorite fountain right there, Spartan Screen. 89 bucks. So let's go over some of these prices here. I'll back up. So those are the prices of the fountains on the top row. Now for the second row here. Princess Tiara. Kisses Daikin. She, my wife, she loves these right there. The uh, Princess Tiara's. And we got an assorted six inch. Orange there. All the fun assortments. Now this one here, this one looks, is almost the size of that um, 16,000 firecracker roll. But um, my best guess, cause it's the, it's the fountain. So that's what most of these are here. Here's your price. Don't know the price on that one there. And I think I missed out on one particular thing here, just wanted to come back to it really quick. These are all fiberglass tubes here. These are all really good. They sell them by the piece. Um, 
I'll get a price quote on those later. And I can't believe I actually missed these. These are 145 for uh, a rack. So these are, these are pretty good prices for racks. This is sturdy. Um, these are really good. So red, white, and blue, perfectly color coded. Uh, these will typically go fast, guys. Um, I would make sure that you guys go ahead and get some racks. You know, they're worth the investment and it saves you guys a lot of money. So. All right, so we have our, oh, you know what? I gave you guys the wrong price on the Spartan Scream. <laughs> uh, the Spartan Scream individually is 35 bucks and it's $89 for the case. So I thought the individual price was 89, but no, that's standard. <laughs> so you get a few of those in the case. You get a couple of those, so pretty good deal. Yeah. Yeah. And Nocturnal Vision. You guys are going to have to do your best judgment. I'm just going to kind of scroll through a lot of this stuff because it's bunched up together to give you guys the best viewing of all of these prices. And let's come back here. There's so many in the novelty section. I'm gonna be bouncing back and forth just to make sure I cover every square inch for you guys. Ah, this used to be no, the rated number one fountain in all of the United States cat calls. But in my personal opinion, uh, this was actually rated by Spirit of 76 years ago. And uh, this was one of my favorites, but Spartan Scream beat it out. They're both 500 grammar fountains. And so um, there you go, 33 bucks for the individual, $95 for the case. And I actually love that website or that uh, YouTube channel. They do a really good job of presentation. Flaming Orbit. Hot Lava. I know someone was just asking a few days ago. Did Red Apple Fireworks still have the snow cone? Yeah, they do. All right, and there's your snow cone. That one person that was asking about it. Can't remember where I saw the comment. So 19 bucks for the unit. I'm not sure if they sell these by the case anymore. Okay. Let's go ahead and move it down. Oh, this one looks really interesting. I wonder what this one does. All the rage. Seven bucks, definitely worth the buy just to see what that does. 
That's the one cool thing about the novelties and the fountains. They have some really good manufacturers out there that provide some really good effects. So you don't buy those for the Big Bang. You buy those to see exactly what it may do when you light it. Ghost Mansion, another good one. Secret Garden too, so. All right guys, moving on. I think this will be the last of the fountains. Some of these you guys may have already seen before. Okay, and school power. Ah, all right, guys. So, this is the new one that Doug has been talking about. We talked about on our uh, interview a few weeks ago. This is the Tiger's Roar. This one goes for $35 a piece, $96 for the case. I believe there's two of them in a box. And this is the one that even is supposed to out trump the Spartan Scream. So I haven't actually shot this one off. Uh, I will sometime uh, when everything, this pandemic and stuff is over. But um, I'll have my eye on this one. I have to hear it in person to find out exactly how it compares to Spartan Scream. And, I'll give it the thumbs up approval. But this is the one to watch out for if you guys are looking for a 500 gram or cake. And if you guys have been watching my other videos, me personally, I love 500 grams. I'm sorry, not cake, but fountains because you're gonna get more bang for your buck. You're gonna get a show instead of buying all the smaller ones and hoping for the best. So, but if that's your thing, more power to you. All right. And so we have concluded the final view of the store going this way this is from when you first walk in this is everything here so i wanted to go ahead and knock that out for you guys and then of course we have our red apple fireworks garb we have our bags our t-shirts and everything but we are not finished because i have this entire section over here to do this is where the fountains and other novelties used to be so you still got some stuff over here so we're going to go ahead and knock that out I'm gonna try to run through this because this is just so much stuff here. So let's go ahead and take care of it. Got our sparklers and stuff, but we'll come back to that last. Uh, over here we have all of our neon fusions these are our roman candles so yeah these are some great prices these are how many shots are in this one let me see 100 shots so most is just to make a quick reference point most of these roman candles are anywhere between 100 shots to possibly 300. I know Red Apple Fireworks has sold uh, 300 shot um, Roman candles. Uh, 190, 120, I think it was, that they've sold before when they were UVs and whatnot, so. Oh, Jesus, what the is this one? This one's 192, so this is the bamboo yeah bamboo shoots panda 192 shots this one's a little thicker 
And remember, you're not supposed to hold these in your hand. You're supposed to put them in a trash can or mount them in the ground some kind of way. So, all right, seventy-five dollars for the case. I don't have an individual price on that one, but you guys have seen all these before. Neon 100 shot neon barrage candle. So. Come on, man. Calavetta. UV. These are other Roman candles here. Pyro stars. So these are your smaller Roman candles here, guys. A lot of these have good rapport. Let's get a shot at those real quick. So I think I'm going to knock out this wall first and then come back to these. So I just want to make sure we get everything covered. You guys don't miss out. And I have not even forgotten the shell. So I'll save that for last. Okay, so most of the prices are here in the middle. Oops. That's definitely a way to win a battle. Get a sword and a gun. <laughs> All right. Signature series. These are other smaller Roman candles in the pack. And remember, you guys can find all this on redapplefireworks.com. And that's, that's the purpose of this video is to make sure that you are fully aware of everything you can buy here. So that's the purpose of this walk around. Uh, just wanted to, in case anybody just decided to skip to the end of this video. So that way you guys get an interactive view of what's in store. Little bangers, Starfighter. Um, never seen any of these before. These are all Roman candles, so this is like all new stuff. Three bucks, three dollars and fifty cent. That's new. All right, so there you guys go. I think that completes all of the Roman candles. So this whole wall that used to be back here for novelties and fountains and everything else, it is all dedicated now to. Uh, Roman candles so move it on against this back wall and then we will finish with these little novelties and then we will do the shells uh, another daytime firework this one puts up 30 shots I believe this is all color so this one is equivalent to um, What's the name of that? Uh, the Smoke Dragon. So, but this one has more powder in it. And these are really heavy. So, they have a lot of powder, powder in them. $45 is the standard price for a daytime firework. Sometimes those are usually priced around 55 or so. So, it's a, it's a good deal. Rockets. Okay. Well, let me come back to some of these prices. I know you guys want to see them. 
And when you're looking at some of these rockets, you know, rockets, you're just keeping them in a certain price range. Not that they really need to be too specific, but anything around 20 bucks is like your average rockets. So, all right. All right, so now we have some additional rockets over here. Now remember, some of this stuff may be mixed in, but just so you guys have a clear idea about what you guys are getting. Um, I know me personally, when I shop, I shop for a price point. So if you told me, like, let's say for example, $12 for a particular set of rockets, okay, I would say okay, or 20 bucks, whatever the case might be. And then you have your smaller rockets here. These are $3 for a bundle. So you're gonna get a spindle of these for three bucks. $75 for a case. And you're getting 72 of these in a case. Jesus Christ. How many do you need? I know what somebody's saying right now. It's not for me, Keo. <laughs> All right, so we have some other rockets. And right behind me are the fountains, just so you guys have another reference point and we're at the back of the store. That 12. So, so as you guys see, all these are roughly the same price. Those are the same ones, I believe. Get five of those. This is like another good deal. How many rockets are in there? It looks like nine. Two, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. That's a good buy right there. 13 rockets, 35 bucks, 155 for the case. It's not too bad. I know typically a set like this would only cost, well, not how many, you only get like maybe nine or so. A little bit smaller, but those are some, these are some pretty good rockets. Also keep in mind too, that this is just for cosmetics. I know that this one's the cap came off, so that has nothing to do with the quality or, of the product. So this is just all cosmetics, whether they're on there or not, or whatever the case might be. So in case you guys are wondering. So roughly all these are somewhere within the 10 to $15 price range for all these rockets here. So that's roughly what you're looking at spending when you guys are pricing this stuff. Oh yeah, this is what I was talking about. $10 for 100 or 110 for a pack. So if you get about Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Okay, so you get some more in there. I think this one has two, four, six, eight, ten. You yeah, have ten rockets in there for Neon Fusion. That's a great deal for the pack. So that's roughly the price range you guys are looking at for all your rockets. All right, moving on. Last but not least, I think we've covered the entire store. Oh shoot! Uh, no, we're gonna get shells last. All right, let's go back here to the middle. So again, I'm just going to, uh, these are fountains. Um, let me come back over here. So we have the Moonflower. These are extra large sparklers. I love sparklers and extra large, you got 96. Uh, these usually have almost a two or three minute duration for some of these. So let's just walk around really quick. I don't think too many people order on redapplefibers.com for a lot of novelties, but if you do, or if you're making a big order, then happy to be a service. Yeah, I did a video on these. These are pretty good. They last almost three minutes. So I highly recommend these wedding sparklers. Dollar fifty, five bucks.
you got your swords here you got your guns um, love both of these great duration these are fountains so you guys can hold these in your hands um, I never posted my video of these things but these are recommended if you guys get these in a case because you guys run out of these pretty fast also the swords too unless you're into that kinky stuff yeah. you guys go <laughs> and you also got a big sword there too all of these go for six dollars or 129 for the case you guys get a great deal there and then we have our zoom flowers aerial spinners i don't have any experience with any of this stuff because you look brand new uh, in terms of product line so. yeah we got our neon zap now these snaps these things are loud i mean i'd recommend some snaps definitely great if you guys plan on building your own assortments And then of course we have some of my other personal favorites. Um, we have our smoke balls. Love smokes. I love smoking out the entire neighborhood. Uh, you mix these, now not the color smokes, but you take the regular white ones, mix it in with your strobe lights and you guys have an awesome show. It looks like a bunch of UFOs or whatever landed down. But uh, my sister taught me that years ago. Like mix the strobe lights in with the regular smokes and it creates a cool effect. So this is what you guys are getting for all of these for the case or individually. $2 for the unit, $139, $139 for the case for those. Uh, they also have a pretty good duration. I know myself, also uh, CZ, American Patriot. Uh, I think they last for about a good two and a half minutes, but they have a pretty good duration on all these smokes. And I do believe this one lasts for about five minutes too. So uh, this is also another good smoke. This one's white. colors in those are very rich very sound then you also have the grenades there they also put out a good duration too fills up the neighborhood with a lot of smoke so you guys will be interested in those all right uh this is our last end cap in the store so i'm gonna go ahead and knock this out All of these are fountains. You can hold these safely. Uh, make sure you guys, if you guys have kids, you're careful. All of these are fountains. So you guys can hold these, plant them in the ground. Looks like a tiki torch, but all of them have great effects there. Love these neon sparklers here. These things are really bright. So if you guys don't have any experience with those, Ah, Ninja Stars, gotta love those. Those sent the neighbors running everywhere. Because <laughs> what this does, it spins on the ground. I really prefer these over flower bloomers. They spin on the ground and then they shoot these little balls out and they spark and they, yeah, all over the place. You have no idea where they're going. So those are pretty cr uh, crazy. So light those and make sure you hide behind something. Um, that top row doesn't have any prices, but typically these usually go for about $12 individually, I think. Again, check the website, so. Uh, disco flashes, gotta love those. That's what I was talking about earlier about creating the whole UFO neighborhood effect. Like that with a bunch of smokes and you guys would be really happy. trying to get in here and get you guys some prices on some stuff and remember a lot of these novelties you're not I'm not gonna have information on because uh, that's the true beauty of having a firework is lighting it and seeing what it does so they're not gonna be repeated effects um well before I get ahead of myself coin it's a booby trap the price on that is $1.50 noise maker 
So you got all these cool novelties here. Uh, this one, this one is probably like the, um, I think all those things. I think they're called balls or something. Anyway, another one of my favorite fireworks. So I think this is equivalent to those. Speed balls, yes, oh my God, yeah. This is what I call fire crack. So I believe these are equivalent because they look the same. Uh, twister sticks, so make sure you guys get a case of those because you will go through those like water. I'm addicted to those things. They make a little whistling sound. They spin on the ground, make a little whistling sound, and then shoot off into the air. So those are pretty cool. You can light those all day, every day. All right. Again, these are just all your random novelties. I remember when I was first looking at fireworks and wanted to kind of price everything, I was really looking at the novelties because those are what really got my attention because of all the different effects they could do. And I know one in particular, um, I don't think they really make it anymore, was that firework car carrier. So that was one of the best novelties I've ever seen because of what it could do. You know, it doesn't have a lot of duration and stuff, but they're just pretty cool. So that's what I love. Uh, these right here, these are called the wheeling wheel. So uh, what you do is you guys put these into a tree, uh, nail it in the middle. It's supposed to come with a nail and it's supposed to spin. So these all work pretty good. Just make sure you maintain your distance and everything. So just keep in mind, these are all handmade and stuff. So make sure you always execute caution first. So you can get one of these for $350, $125 for the case. Excellent buy. Those things are pretty good. All right, guys, that completes the novelty section. No, it doesn't. <laughs> All right, so we got one last one here. Oh, here we go right here, the Spy Mobile. So this one is another interesting firework. That's what I was talking about. They do carry it. So they are $8 or 175 for the case. So excellent. Uh, I believe this one, if it's the one I'm thinking about, has two cars. So you light it. Uh, the, I think it shoots sparks from the front and then uh, the back lets down. It shoots out two cars. Like if you guys are familiar with Knight Rider back in the day, a uh, kit would come out. So I think that's probably where they got the idea and the two cars would come out pretty cool and these are your other smokes so this there's smokes on each side um, really no preference so you just get a different assortment of uh, smokes here <coughs> excuse me uh, $10 for a pack 125 for a case and these are all top-notch great duration and I think that's one of the most important parts about getting smokes is you get some duration because 
Nobody, oh, six minute. Now this is brand new. I've never seen these. So uh, these are four minutes. I'm sorry, $4. <laughs> four dollars. Uh, these are four bucks, six minute smokes. I've never seen anything um, last as long as far as duration. So excellent pricing, excellent pricing, great. Now, I believe this is for a gender reveal party. So this is something great if you guys are into weddings or anything. Um, these are really good. If you're a wedding planner and looking for, or if you guys are just husband, wife, couple, or whatever the case might be, girlfriend, boyfriend, um, and you have a baby on the way, this is what you want to invest in. These are the uh, Pretty in Paint 60 Seconds and then Blue for a gender reveal party. So these are great for those occasions. And of course we have some more smoke balls. These are your entry level smoke. So typically you can also find these in some of the assortments. It looks like they got some smaller hand grenade smokes over here too. $1.50. And all these here are for the price of $2.50. And here we go. The last of the novelties there. Different prices. These are kind of all bundled up together. You see, you guys can see. And a lot of these are down here too. I think I already went over them. So just to show you guys the prices. And that completes our novelty section. 24 minutes worth. 24 minutes worth of novelties. All right, guys, let's move on to the shells. All right, finally, here we are. We've reached the end. I'm glad you guys have been watching this entire time. So this is what you guys have been really waiting for is what are the prices on the Red Apple shells? So let's get down to it. This should be really easy to knock out. We've got this whole back row uh, of the store. This is where the assortments used to be for those of you guys familiar with Red Apple Fireworks. So I just wanted to create a reference point if you're like, hey, that guy Kia was on this video and can you guys grab that from the back for me? So here you guys are, Doom Barrel Bombs, $55 for the unit, $145 for the case. And I do believe there's three in a case. So you're gonna get all those shells, you're gonna get three shell kits, a total of 72 shells. Uh, each one you guys are gonna get four fiberglass tubes. Those tubes will last you quite some time. Um, so there's some good quality stuff. And this is Red Apple Fireworks Top Notch Shell. So I've been told for this year are the new Chroma Shells, five inch XL canister shells, the ones in the white box, not the ones that you guys have seen in previous years. So you guys are getting those here. These are $59 for the unit, $145 for the case. Great deal. You guys are getting this assortment of shells for that price. <coughs> I know these are gonna go fast. So um, they still have pandas as well, but these are some great shells right here, guys. Five inch XL canister shells. That's what Red Apple is known for, five inch uh, XL shells and also six inch. Six inch was introduced, I believe two years ago. Five inch was introduced about three years ago, I believe it was. So there you guys go. Um, and here we have Detroit Fireworks Company, $45 for the unit, $190 for the case. Also check out many of Red Apple Fireworks other locations. They have some stuff in stock too. Signature series, this is Smoke and Mirrors. Uh, I'm not familiar with this one. So $59 for the box, $135 for the case. And remember most of these will have three in a box for the case. <coughs> Signature series. Signature series Voyager Large Canister Shell, $160 for the case. Uh, I believe this one, as you know, as you guys have been with me on this journey, um, they're not selling these individually, so you're gonna get all those in the box. So this looks like what you're gonna get here. Ooh! Hey, Doug! You got the Everest back in? It looks like they're a part of the Voyager bundle. Ooh, okay, so typically Everest, I believe, only has five shells. I love those shells. Those shells, <laughs> those are some good shells on Everest. So 
Um, it has to be bound up. So these are not sold individually. You have to get them in this case. So you're getting um, 24 canister shell smoke and mirrors. And I believe these two, as I said, you're getting uh, five each. That's usually how the Everest is packaged. It's not packaged with six for two. It's packed with five. Wow. That's a mind blower. All right, moving on. Bombes de la Muerte canister shells. Calavera. And we also have some American Hero here. I don't want to touch anybody order. Let me see if I can squeeze in here. <coughs> These are the old chroma shells. We'll get to those in a minute. Seventy bucks for the unit. One sixty nine for the case. Buy the case. I can't believe you got the Everest back in. Well, no, it's just part of the Voyager, that's all. Yeah, but still. Really, that's, man. I know, man. It was nice to see that one. All right, so three in the box here, five inch XL canister shells, three pack. You guys are familiar with those. You guys saw CZ Celtic do a uh, comparison video several years ago. I'm not sure if it's still online, but uh, these will set off car alarms from the ignition point. So just to give you an idea about if they're loud or not. So they're not really loud once they hit or on, on the uh, explosion, but the ignition part, yeah, it's pretty good. Great color and everything else. All right, these are the standard chroma shells. I believe these were the original ones. Uh, Pyro Star, $55 for the unit, 145 for the case. We're almost to the end. <laughs> we're almost. Can't believe we're almost here. Uh, Triumph Shells, I believe these are packed three to a box. These are $60 for the unit, $150 for the case. Triumph, uh, these really aren't as loud as some of the other shells. They do have a good rapport. They are loud, but these are very bright in color. So that's what these shells, in my personal opinion, are known for. So if you guys are looking to add some color to your show, I would go with the Triumph shells because they're just bright. But um, in case you guys were wondering, I have measured a lot of these Red Apple Fireworks shells. And on average, most of them hit or ignite at about, let's say 175 feet. In, in case you guys were wondering how I know that, um, when I've uh, done, obviously recorded some of the demos and then also uh, did some stuff myself. Uh, I have my drone up there, and so I put my drone at a certain height, roughly 170, 200, and so I, I use my drone to measure it. So it's not actually perfect, but I would tell you that a lot of these shells will launch at about 175 feet, which is really good because you have a lot of distance between yourself and tree lines, which is something I'm personally concerned with. So. Go shell, $45, uh, $40 for the unit, 170 for the case. Three layer at five inch canister shells. How many shells are you getting of these? 12 shells, two fiberglass tools. So you're getting two spindles of six each. Really good, really good quality. Neon Fusion, uh, American Glory. What are you guys doing today? Uh, Killa Ganja. These are killer shells, killer five inch, American Glory. Here you guys go. You guys are getting the individual unit for $18, $16, and $16 here. Again, these are for all your raw stuff that's going on. So these are all of your individual prices here. And you're getting your new Neon Fusion for $24 for the unit, $125 for the case. $24 for the unit, $125 for the case. Uh, we got all these here. So pretty much guys, I think we have ended our journey. We've seen the entire Red Apple Spyworks store. Sorry this video had to be so long, but I had to create a reference point for all of you guys shopping online because, yep. hell, it's just fun. <laughs> I mean, why not? Uh, ganjas, you got six inch ganja shells. I personally love these. I've never seen these before. This is a different color. I'm not familiar with these. But uh, $24 for the unit, $145 for the case. So again, guys, make sure you guys subscribe to my YouTube channel, Keel Dykin. Be busy. So I uh, hope you guys like the coverage that I uh, want to provide for you guys. Um, got some more interesting stuff coming up. Doug says hello. 
So this is all of the Red Apple Fireworks product. They are slowly adding a lot of the stuff to the store. Make sure you guys go to the website, use the coupon code and uh, check out the description and all the other links in the video for you. I make sure I, I usually don't like providing a lot of links, but I wanted to make sure that I was complete with my information as possible. Also too, make sure you subscribe and check out Red Apple Fireworks on their social media, redapplefireworks.com, YouTube, their Facebook, um, what else they have, Instagram, all forms of social media. Also make sure you subscribe to my group, Keel Dyke and Hobbies, arcade, PC, and other stuff going on. I have a lot of that stuff going on for the guys and the groups. And again, this is a hobby channel. We are here to have fun, guys. And so I just wanted to get you guys in preparation for your 4th of July and make sure you guys had all of your fireworks and everything that you needed for all of your pyro accessories. Hope you guys enjoyed this long video. And I am signing out. Hey, there's no popcorn and slushies today. Who gives? <laughs> From Red Apple Fireworks, this is Keo Dykin saying goodbye. Hope you guys have a great day. Catch you guys next time. And hopefully this stuff is over before the 4th of July season. Catch you guys later.